All right, so I had another question from someone that wanted to know, am I getting radiation when I'm uh, traveling, when I'm flying from coast to coast? So I'm gonna talk about that. Well, when you're going from coast to coast in America, you're getting the amount of radiation that would be just less than one chest x-ray, okay? So there is some radiation, not too much. It's not like a CAT scan. When you're doing a transatlantic flight, you're probably getting the radiation that would be equivalent to three dental x-rays. Not too bad, okay? So the radiation exposure uh, really depends on three things. How high your flight is, how long your flight is, and the latitude. For example, um, the further away you fly from the equator, the more the radiation. Because at the equator, you have certain magnetic fields that deflect radiation. Um, now, when you're flying small planes um, underneath clouds, for example, you're getting less radiation. Um, if you can avoid midday flights and fly more at night, you're gonna avoid radiation. And lastly, there are certain foods and things that you can do to protect the cells against damage uh, from radiation. Uh, dark leafy greens, vital. Intermittent fasting, vital. Keeping your refined sugars low, vital. Other things too, like superfoods like garlic, um, onions, turmeric is really good. So there's a whole long list of those foods. Phytonutrients in general can uh, repair that damage. All right, thanks for watching. Hey guys, I wanna talk about these two books right here. Okay, I wanna explain it. This book right here is a very short book. It explains why to do keto and how to do it. It's filled with pictures. You can get through this in 45 minutes real quick. Just very important to know the details, the basics of how to do it. Now this book, The New Body Type Guide, should have been called Beyond Keto because I rarely find someone that has just a weight problem. They usually have a lot of other body problems. And in this book, I cover all the reasons why keto and intermittent fasting might not work for you. We go into the body types, we go into inflammation, we go into stress, hardcore, and what to do about it. So if you wanna maximize your results, you definitely wanna get this one right here, okay? So my goal is to get you to do keto correctly. And what I mean by that is do it healthily. It's called healthy ketosis. So we can avoid all the issues that happen with transitioning the fat burning. Keto flu, keto fatigue, keto rash, kidney stones, gout, etc. And right now on my website, if you get this, you get this at no extra cost. I put a link down below. Check it out.